To learn how to swim, remember, always go slowly. If you go fast, it shows a lot of stress. Take it easy. You don't have to go fast. The more important is to learn how to be relaxed. So swim slowly, blow your bubble five seconds, look inside the water, feel you can fly, remember your legs behind you to kick on the surface, no rush, no stress, and use your hand like you are walking in the water. Imagine you are like a big tiger somehow. You don't have to focus on complicated technique like freestyle now. It's not yet the moment. Right now your objective is just to feel comfortable. We are good, we are good. It's all in your mind. I'm very serious. You have the skill. You just need to let go the fear in your stomach and accept that here everything is safe. You touch the ground, you are with a, with a coach. It's, the environment is super safe. You will never drink water, you know how to blow bubbles, you know how to breathe, you know, everything is fine. Okay? If I don't touch you sometimes, you keep going on the same, on the same intensity. You can do it, okay? Okay, one, two, three, pull down. Good. One, two, three. I hold from the hips now. Pull down. Very good. One, two, three, pull down. That's very good, you see? So I start for a while. Can you feel it? I, at the beginning, you need me to hold your legs, to hold your hands. Now I can hold your shoulders. And at the end, I was holding a bit of your hips, but the rest of the time you do alone. It was because you relax and go slowly. When you want to learn how to swim, if you go fast, you fight. The, the speed is usually a factor of fear. And we don't want the fear. We want you to be super easy in the water. Comfortable, confident, enjoying the sensation of floating, okay? As you can see with these little girls, she is paddling in the water to go up when she needs to take a breath and she swims very relaxed. The only missing point here will be the legs not kicking all the time on the surface of the water, but the paddling is very good.